Welcome back to Sidelines TV. I'm here today at the Wellington Nations Cup for dressage in Wellington, Florida, and I'm lucky enough to have some time with Tammy Hogue, world-renowned author. Tammy, how are you? Very well, thank you. Great. Tammy's had 16 uh, books on the New York Times bestseller list, and a lot of them have involved horses and even Sidelines Magazine. Um, how did all that come about, Tammy? Oh, well, you know, I, I just uh, decided at some point that I wanted to combine the two things that I love the most, writing and riding. And uh, I had spent a couple of seasons here in Florida at that time. This is, you know, 10, 10 12 years ago. And um, it was it was just too tempting <laughs> not, to, not to set a book in Wellington because it's such a fantastic environment. It is sort of like a fairy tale land. It, it is. It's like its own little world and it's... Uh, you know, full of intrigue. Uh, <laughs> it, 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 too. Any you know, any day of the week. So to, yeah. to set a, a thriller here was was a natural. So were you always a dressage writer, or did you start another way? I grew up riding western mostly, and um, and then I, I did a little bit of hunter jumper, and then uh, and then turned to dressage. I, you know, I, I wanted a challenge, and I hadn't done it before, and and had watched a little dressage, and uh, was fascinated with the the intricacies of it. So what's up? We haven't seen you much this season. No, because I've been <laughs> writing a book. <laughs> Usually I finish the, be, right before season, then I have season off, which is perfect. But this book did not want to be written in a, in a timely manner. So uh, I spent the, the entire season uh, locked in my office working like a slave. So, But the book is done, and it will be out the 18th of June. It's called The Ninth Girl. Wow, that was a scoop. Yeah, I, for me, like every other aspiring Hemingway that's never going to do it, what made you sit down with that very first book and decide, this is really what I'm going to do? Well, it, you know, it's what I always wanted to do, always. You know, from, from a small child, I wanted to write. And I think I was in the third grade when I wrote my first story. And uh, you know, we, we had a project where we had to write and illustrate a story and we had to present it to the teacher in a book form. Oh, that's so and, cool. Yeah, and that was that was just it. I was like, oh, I get to create my own world and manipulate everyone in it. <laughs> Ultimate was, control freak. I love that. Fantastic. <laughs> you know, but little did I know that you actually don't have that much control and, you yeah. know, that you create the world and then the characters kind of take over and, um, and they don't always do what you think they will. Is that true? Like that you know your train of thought is this way and then you get hijacked and wind up somewhere else absolutely That's absolutely so cool. yeah it's it's really it's an it's an amazing process and you have to learn to trust that you know the characters are usually right that's so cool. I, I'm speechless about that. <laughs> What's your plans next? Uh, I'm taking a very little time off, and then I'll, I'll start on the next book. Uh, I already have an idea for the next book, and um, so I'll get going on that. And uh, What about writing? I'm back writing again, so that's great. And um, hopefully, hopefully this next book will present itself a little more quickly. So. <laughs> is this also an equestrian related book? This one is not. Uh, it's, uh, it's a book about a woman who was a victim and how that impacts her life and how it uh, colors her perception of the people that she's known all her life. Great. Well, Tammy, thank you so much for taking the time with us. Thank you. Great. For Sidelines TV, I'm Rob Jordan.